Next night, me and Doc Holler. I'm gonna see if we can't go up here and get on one. Doc ain't been solo on one in here in a little while, so let's see what we can't do. Hey, go. <coughs> Doc to him. There's your coon, boys. See the ladies running right there. Good boy. Good boy, Doc. Good boy. Talk to him. Talk to him. That's a good boy. Talk to him. That's a good boy. Good boy. Good boy, Doc. Good boy. Talk to him. You want to be proud of you, son. They're going to turn the tree down, boys. Good boy. Thank you, Lord. Hey, boys. All I got to say with that one is sometimes you just got to ask the good Lord up above. And he'll deliver. We walked uh, walked all my all the way up through there. Doc's uh, he's had having confidence issues here lately, and uh, we kind of quit hunting him once uh, once Sally got sick, and he uh, he's struggling to get back going. Um, she took off pretty pretty quick once we got that first coon to her, but uh, he's he's struggling a little bit. Um, he's treeing, I, I swear he's treeing. He's treed several coons. Um, he just hasn't had the confidence. He he's a real. He wants to be accurate, and if he's not sure, he won't. He won't bark, so if he he went out several times, probably four, five, six, seven times, I don't know. He'd go out a little bit, and he'd get where he was thinking about it. He'd come back to me. We'd walk a little farther in the woods. He'd go out again. I'd stand there wait for him. He'd come back, and we'd walk a little farther. Till finally, I uh, I just stand there and I did a little pray, and then the dog went down through there, and he went downhill from me, which is not really what I wanted him to do. But I wasn't going to correct him. I was letting him do his thing, and. He struck in. I thought he was gonna fell a tree right there, but uh, he didn't. He he kind of milled around there for a little bit, and then come back around, probably another sixty or so yards from where he struck in at, and just bled out a big locate. I'm talking, give you chills, kind of locate. I was probably I was probably only eighty yards from him. He located and fell a tree right there, and he had to meet. And I'm I'm super proud of him. I'm I'm very thankful, very very thankful for that one. So he needed it, and I think I needed it too. So. I want to thank you all for watching. I'm not going to ramble too much. I just want to thank you all for watching. If you haven't yet, um, please leave us a like. Please leave us, uh, subscribe. It helps us out a lot. It helps us do what we're... we got a lot of plans. And uh, I really appreciate you all uh, showing me the support and, and all that. And uh, it just means a lot. So thank you all. And I'll catch you on the next one.